Today is February 2nd, 2-2. It's a Friday. It is a day when I got a call uh, from, a, from a company that I used to work for. They stated that they were afraid of me and that they had to give me a call over the phone and that uh, my stuff will be uh, boxed up and uh, sent to me through mail. And that, uh, that was February 2nd, 2-2 of several years, many, many years ago. Today is a new day. It's a Friday. I work for myself. Nobody gives me a box. I give myself a box, but I don't give myself a box. As God knows, he created me for a purpose, and I need to fulfill that promise, that, that, that purpose. Despite the fact that, that I've lost now approximately about 50 challenges, even though it's cheaper, uh, failing more often just makes it uh, just <laughs> it costs about the same amount and uh, so what I need to do now is buckle down okay buckle down and really think about it because what I did was um, I blew another account but at this time it t it's it was faster it was faster because I bought it and then within less than an hour, I blew the account. Within less than an hour. So based on my calculation, that's like uh, a wage that is, um, that's far more expensive than washing. It's, it's at a higher spending rate than the earning power that I have as a dishwasher. Which means what I need to do is, what I normally do is I park my car right in front of the office because it's free. And then before the meter starts at 8 o'clock in the morning, I move my car to the parking garage. I parked it. But my mind was still on trading. And everything that I did was automatic pilot. But still, my thinking was... How do I get better? How, how do I do things? And then when I came back, which, uh, which is like one block, which is a decent exercise, and I sat here and I'm thinking, hmm, did I turn the light off? Okay. So then it's drizzling outside. If it was a bit colder, it would be snow. But it's already in February, which means that winter has come and gone, essentially. And spring is right here. Spring is right around the corner. So I had to walk all the way back, and uh, and on the second floor, I looked at my car, all the lights were off, which meant that I turned the light off, and I didn't even realize it, because everything was just the automatic pilot. So I came back, as I was coming back, I'm thinking to myself, you know what, if I keep doing this, I'm going to be doing this for the blowing accounts for years I could be doing this for the whole year until un, until I push up the daisies. It's going to keep I'm going to keep doing the same thing over and over again. I have to change. Something has to change. And what is that change that I need to make? I need to figure that out. It's something it's something that uh it's something that it's 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 blatantly obvious. It's like what you don't know, you just don't know. What you don't know, you just don't know. It's a simple fact. What you do not know, you don't know. And you'll keep repeating it, repeating it, repeating it. There's some signs out there to see what's causing that change. But unless I look at it and actively change it, then it's going to repeat because you don't know what you don't know. And... There's a statement called, if you do the same thing, expecting different results, that's like you don't know, and you just don't know, and you keep doing it. 
because even though the signs are all out there, so I have to make I have to make I have to make this change. I have to make a change to my trading. Otherwise, I'm going to keep doing this over and over and over and over uh, years down the road. I'm going to keep doing this over and over. And what's going to happen is I'm going to get old. So the, the, the price is time and money. Those are the two things. And relationships. Because this, this preoccupation is a endless cycle of doing the same thing, pre preoccupying 100% of the resources, mind, body, and soul into this thing without making any progress. And that is a perpetual way of, it's like, it's like that guy who went up to the mountain for 20 years, okay, and then, and then slept. It's essentially, whoever that guy is, is the same thing, is what you don't know, you just don't know, because he's in the mountains, detached from the world, completely disconnected, and then, 20 years later, came back down to discover what's new. And that, coming back down, is essentially, essentially uh, breaking free from complete devotion to whatever it is, in this case, day trading. And because of the unsuccessful current disposition, I'm preoccupying 100% of my resources, attempting to figure this thing out. I already see a sign that says, look, if I keep doing this, I'm gonna, it's gonna, nothing's gonna change. So I have to make some change because what is known is that time is flowing, the cost, the, the resources are being uh, extinguished. Everything around me is getting older uh, and things need to be replaced, but I can't replace it. So something has to change. Something, something needs to change. However, I don't. What I don't know, I don't know. So I need to figure this out. What I don't know, I don't know. So I need to figure this out. I need to figure that out. I need to figure it out. 